I'm Nick Vinzan, and right now we're live in Scottsdale, where today is the first day of spring training workouts for the Arizona Diamondbacks. It's a big baseball competition that's really getting underway right now, but there's an even bigger competition that's happening all over the valley. These men are in a race against time. For 26 years, they've ran a baseball card and memorabilia store out of their homes. Now, they're trying to get a new store ready before the first big spring training crowds arrive. Oh, the store is uh, number one concern right now. Uh, we're about two weeks from opening. Uh, couch and seating area for you as well. Travis Giles is in a different kind of competition. As a hotel manager, he's competing for the estimated 1.7 million spring training fans that will come to the Valley. To get them, Giles says he's offering a special spring training hotel package, including a discounted room, snacks, drinks, and even a ride to the ballpark. A lot of hotels in this area do not have transportation to and from the ballparks. Spring training is an incredibly crucial time for the Valley. For hotels, it's the busiest and most profitable time of year. More than $600 million in economic impact is generated. But it goes fast. And that's why Brian Marcy says his store has to be ready. Because once May, June, July, August hits, there's no one in town. Everyone's out of town. Now, when we talk to local officials, they're expecting most of the 1.7 million fans they're expecting to show up for spring training to start arriving towards the end of February, the early part of March when the games get started. Back to you.